This guide will help you to add Poll Everywhere polls to your presentation. The guide is for PC users only. There are five easy steps. The first is go to polleverywhere.com and download the presenter app. Two, follow the installation procedure. Three, open PowerPoint. Four, click on the new Poll Everywhere tab that you will now see on your menu bar. And five, click insert the poll. The following slides will walk you through each of these steps. When you go to polleverywhere.com, log in to your account. You'll see on the dashboard that there is a white left-hand column. You'll see the word create and import as you do here on the screen. Towards the bottom of that list, you'll see a, an icon for PowerPoint. Click here and this will bring you to the page to download the add-on that will work inside of your PowerPoint application. Now you will see the download screen in Poll Everywhere on the website. Click the download button and Poll Everywhere will send the pollev.exe or execution file to your downloads folder. If you're using a browser such as Chrome, you may also see it at the bottom left hand side of your browser screen. You may open it in the browser as you see in image 2 here or you can go to your downloads folder and double click. When you open the polev.exe file you will see the dialog window in image 3 on the screen here. Click run and then follow the rest of the installation instructions. Please be sure that your PowerPoint application is closed during this time otherwise your computer will not allow the installation of the add-on to the menu in your PowerPoint application. When the installation of the add-on is complete, reopen your PowerPoint application. You will now see a menu for Poll Everywhere on your PowerPoint menu alongside the tabs that had been there before. Click on Poll Everywhere and you will see a list of items come up that provide you with the features of Poll Everywhere that you will be able to use in PowerPoint. First of all, as the image shows here, you can insert a new poll. That is, if you click on New, it will ask you what kind of poll or question you want to create and allow you to create the question and add it all at once inside PowerPoint. If you've already created polls, on the Poll Everywhere site and you would like to use those, you would click Insert, select the poll, and insert it in the presentation. You can also see here that your identity would be listed. Mine is here. Uh, you will have to use your own. And what that means is if you're not logged in, it will ask you to log in. If you're using Poll Everywhere to present on another machine, make sure you log out before leaving, especially if that machine is a public access computer. If you are inserting a poll that you've already created online at the Poll Everywhere site, when you click Insert, you will see a list of your polls. Click on the ones you want and then click Insert, and the poll will appear in your presentation. This is what you will see in editing mode when you're in PowerPoint and you insert a Poll Everywhere poll. It looks pretty much like a placeholder, but it does identify for you the particular poll question that you've inserted. When you press the presenter icon, you will see the actual so poll activated for your audience and ready to accept responses. To where it's going to present and activate your poll, this is what you will see. And as responses come in, uh, you will see the responses appear on the screen. So here's an example 
of as quickly seeing the responses as they come in from the audience. Please don't hesitate to contact me if you have any questions about this process or if you'd like some other tips for using Poll Everywhere on a Mac or creating different types of questions used with large audiences or small groups. I'm happy to help. Good luck.